Bob? Packer News now at NBC 26 Live at 6. Three days and counting to the big matchup between the Packers and the Vikings. Green Bay takes on Minnesota. Big Monday night game. Green Bay 2-1. and one. They'll face the undefeated Vikings, led by former Packers quarterback Brett Favre. That's stuff that, that's media stuff. I don't, I don't really get into that at all. It, to me, this is just not a game. You know, it's an important game for us. We want to win all of, all of our division games. We have six opportunities. Uh, we took care of Chicago the first week. Uh, we know our division is going to be very tough this year, but uh, I'm just focused on, uh, you know, that Viking defense. A game that's all Green Bay fans sure to watch, but could Favre have known all along that he was going to end up with the Vikings, or was he hoping that? NBC 26 video journalist Eric Peterson at Brett Favre's Old Ash Wobbin and Home with more. It's been more than a year since Brett Favre and his family moved out of this house, leaving quite a legacy for all of Titletown. But for the people who moved in here, he may have left a clue as to what he really wanted to do. While cleaning out Brett Favre's old basement, new owner David Pearson found some paint. We knew the paint was here, we just never paid attention to what the paint was for. When I picked it up and read it, I started to laugh and my wife looked at me like I was nuts. Pearson thought this could be a sign from Favre himself. If it was purple, who cares? But the fact that it's called potentially purple, and for the last two years, we didn't know if he was going to the Vikings or not, but the potential exists. Potential indeed. Favre is off to Minnesota, and Pearson has a souvenir. It's an interesting conversation piece. Pearson hopes Favre will put the finishing touch on his masterpiece with an autograph. If he were to stop by and sign this can of paint, it would find a place on my mantle. No word on that quite yet. But was Favre giving some sort of sign as he waved goodbye for the last time? Did he have the potential to predict his own purple future? We may never know, but Pearson says Favre is welcome anytime to sort it all out. In your corner in Ashwaubenon, Eric Peterson, NBC 26. Well, the win has